Welcome all to Fashion Designs by Vanessa. We are actually going to be doing a remake of this dress. You will need a pencil, two permanent markers of different colors, two color pencils of the two different colors, and drawing paper. Let's begin. First thing you'll do, you'll draw an oval for the head. Now, make sure, just for it to be precise, make sure your thumb can fit inside your shape. Then two shorter lines underneath your oval. Draw a short curvy line at each side. In a sense, it should be like a slant, a slant for your shoulders. Now we're gonna curve each side of your slants. This will actually be like the part of your shoulders, halfway of your shoulders. A circle, the rounder part of your shoulders. These are guiding circles, basically. You're gonna erase them eventually. Make two curves underneath your shoulder lines. Now this is gonna lead us into the bust line. We're just gonna make a little curve for the bust line. And you do the same thing with the other side. Now you're gonna make another curvy line. Now that you have formed her waist, we're gonna form it into her hips as well as her thighs. You'll do this by going downward, but curving it, giving her shape. You extend your lines all the way down. If you seem to not be getting it the first time, it's okay. You can still erase and reform her body structure. Now we extend her shape all the way down. Seems like you're gonna be closing in, but then you're gonna open up at the end. Now we're gonna tackle her arms. Remember those circles that you made? You can now erase them. You don't need them anymore. They were to guide you. Now we're gonna extend two longer lines at each side from an angle, and then we're gonna curve it. We're gonna make we're gonna do this in order to make it seem like her arms are going behind her. And you're gonna do that for both sides. Okay. If her arms at first looks a little boxy, you can still Erase and play with it to give it a more feminine look. Now you're going to erase those curvy lines that you made to start your dress. Next. You will close in your dress a little bit more and then you're going to open it up. And this will make your dress mermaid style. Now we're going to draw a line underneath to curve it. And this will be the bottom of your dress to give your dress a little more length. You can erase all lines that you don't need at this moment. Now to give your dress more a sort of like a width or just to see like a side view of the dress you can extend parallel lines on the side of the dress but make sure they're not the same length they're not the same length as the first lines that you have i make one shorter than the other now we're going to curve it but usually when i curve it I leave a little space on the side and then I, and I curve it underneath it so I don't curve it exactly where it is. And this is just a perspective thing, but you can add lines from where your dress ends or your side view ends and this would give it a perspective look of she's on the, she's on the floor or she's standing up. Make sure those lines are, are somewhat straight. 
Okay. Now I'm just going over in my pencil, darkening everything up. Now we're going to erase the bust line. You don't need them anymore. They were just to guide you as in into her figure.